thanks for joining me today with Stamping with Loretta. Um, today we are going to do this very adorable um, envelope for a child's lunch money. You can do this boy or girl themed according to um, your child and what he or she likes. This one I did for a little girl in honor of my, my niece Melissa. Okay, this is using Claudia um, Cal Topper from Digital Delights and um, she has some wonderful, wonderful images on her website right now. They're just so cute and fun to use. So let's get started. This is so easy. Okay, first you're going to need to print out the cow onto cardstock. I used a um, cream colored cardstock and I fussy cut around the image. So now what I'm going to do is to make her face a little bit more dimensional we're going to cut out just the face portion as I'm cutting this out I'm going to remind you that I'm pretty much I'm moving the paper and not the scissors um, this just makes sure that I don't have any um, sharp cut lines and the curves stay curvy. So that's why we do that. And I'm going to put a couple dimensionals on the back of this. One here and one here. Take the backing off. I'm going to layer this piece on top of the one on the bottom. I'm going to take a Galaxy white marker and give her some more little white dots in her ears and on her hooves. Just add to a little interest there. And I'm going to set that up out of my way to dry. Okay, this is just a standard envelope. It measures oh, but does it measure? five and three quarters by four and a half. So it's standard A2. I'm gonna flip it over and I'm gonna take my paper and just wrap it around the envelope. No reason to um, score it in advance. It will score on its own just fine. Um, this piece measures 12 inches by one inch. It's just a piece of gray scrapbooking paper that I have in my stash. I do not know who makes this, ladies. I'm sorry that I don't. So There it is attached to the back. We're going to turn it over to the front and we're going to take our cowl and we're going to just simply use some tape and position the image over the strip. Just like that. Now, I put new money on mine. You can put milk money on yours. And it's nice to add the child's name. Um, this is a Ink Essentials Enamel White um, paint. It's by Ranger. And start it. And write your, your child's name. And then you can also use the same paint since it is dimensional. And go back over some of your dots just so that um, they have a little bit of depth. It just makes it more interesting. And if you do stick your hand in it, don't worry. It should be fine. And so, we're going to lay that aside for just a second. And I'm going to bring this down. And I'm going to show you this one. On the inside of the envelope flap, I have placed a safety pin and that is because if your child is really little and you don't want him or her to lose their their milk money their lunch money then it's best to use this envelope and pin it to the front of their shirt then when they get to school their teacher sees that it's their lunch money and uh, she can um, take it out what she can also do is she can keep the envelope and what we're going to do is we're going to shrink down one of these Claudia the Cows real quick with our heat gun. I 
love shrinking plastic. It's so much fun. I love the way it kind of morphs and it curls up and it just kind of goes nuts on you. And in the end, most of the time, they turn out just fine. And this one was no exception. It turned out just fine. Put a block on top of that. Cool it off for a second and flatten it out. I'm using a pretty good amount of pressure just to make sure that she's flat. Okay. And then what you do with it is you put it in the envelope. And when the envelope comes home and you see the little cow inside, then you know it's time for more lunch, Mini Mom. So that's the uh, finished envelope. You can embellish the envelope further with um, ribbon. This particular ribbon is single-sided in the fact that the pattern is only on one side. So to tie that bow, I'm going to tie a bow just like I went on a pair of sheets. I'm going to start with one loop, come around, and this is where it gets different. So the, the pattern is all on the outside. I'm going to take my finger and I'm going to push it through. And make a bow like that. Okay, you get you kind of get the idea. My um, my sweetheart just came home, so the dogs are getting loud there in the background. So you tie your bow, and you use a glue dot and attach it to your card so that when it's finished, it looks like this. This um, this product from Ranger, the Ink Essentials Enamel, is thick. It will take it a while to dry probably about half an hour for most names. Um, I'd even give it an hour. Just let it sit somewhere and dry. So, thanks for joining me today with Stampin' with Loretta and this Digital Delights tutorial on using Claudia the Cow to make an adorable milk money holder. Have a great day. Stamp happy.